So my name is Rebecca Bloom. I'm an art therapist and a licensed mental health counselor in Seattle. Uh, this is my book, Square the Circle, art therapy workbook that I've created for people who are interested in art therapy and creativity in general. If you're a doodler, if you're a creative journaler, if you're someone who's doing yoga and wants to explore beyond the asanas into the creative aspect of the eight limbs of yoga, this is a great book for you. So I've developed it after 15 years in the field of wanting to find a more body-based, more mindfulness-based set of exercises out there. There's tons of coloring sheets in here. There's creative prompts. All the images in here were created by me and a talented group of graphic artists. So they're very specific to allowing you to easily access emotions and experiences and put them down on the page in any way that feels right. I think creativity is the best gift that we have to give the world. It's one of the most lasting ways that cultures make their mark on society. Long after the words are gone and the music are gone, the images are still there. So get out there and make some art. <laughs> <laughs> so this book you're hoping that art therapists will buy and use with their clients. Yes. And anyone that's interested in safely exploring art with their clients that maybe doesn't know how, therapists all the time, verbal therapists come to me and say, what can I do with my client that has nothing to talk about? And I suggest other people's books that are full of directives. And now I can recommend my own book. So even if someone isn't certified as an art therapist, you're right. saying if you are a good therapist and have a little bit of consultation, you can use this book in your practice. Yes. Yeah, so you can order it on Amazon or through Book Locker. It's only $13.95. Or maybe on Amazon it's like $12.95. So what's the directive with, with these guys? So I, many clients come in and say, you know, I wish my life was calm, but I don't even know what that would look like. And so what I'll do in a session is draw a perfect circle freehand and write the word calm in the middle and hand it to the client and say, fill this in with whatever calmness means to you. The circle gives some level of containment and the word calm is just a constant prompt to keep people focused on what we're trying to do. I'm eternally fascinated by art therapy and I learned today that it's okay for me to occasionally use art directives even though I'm not an art therapist. I think you can safely use the exercises in my book. Awesome. And what's the name of the book again? A Square the Circle Art Therapy Workbook. And selling for about $13 on Amazon. About $13 on Amazon. Awesome. Oh, and if you want to buy it in bulk, go to Book Locker and get a major discount, especially if you buy 100 <laughs>